Hello everyone, it's Elle from Team Up Form over here and for today's video, I will be teaching you guys how to create a simple order form and also I will show you where to get a free template from Google Form. So I hope you stay until the end so I can teach you new things. Okay, so let's get started. First, I will show you where to get the free template of an order form in Google Forms. So of course, you have to navigate to Google Forms first and once you have done that, you just have to click on the template gallery over here and scroll a little bit downwards and then you will see that there's an order form template. So once you click that, you should be able to see um, a pre-made order form. So of course, you can edit as, as much as you want since Google Forms is very customizable, so in this um, case, you can add in some more details, such as if you want to add in actual colors over here, you can do so just like that. Also, you can add more questions, so apart from this one, you can um, add in, for example, if you want them to pay right away, you can add in an option where it says upload proof of payment. So what you have to do is to click on file upload and then type in the title of the section. So in this case, let's just put proof of payment. So if you want to view how it looks like, then the form looks like this. It's like that. So as you can see, um, once you have sent this to possible respondents, then they should be able to order um, a product from you. So, of course, you can change everything here. As I've said, Google Forms is very customizable. So that's it for the template. It's very useful if you don't want to create one from scratch. So yes, there's that. And another part of this video is I will show you guys an actual order form. So here it is. So here is an example of a K-pop merchandise order form. So as you can see, it has a customized header. So you can do that by going over here and uploading an image from your um, folders. So yes, let's scroll a bit downwards and you can see some of the details. As you can see, it asks for the buyer's full name, their Twitter username, if that's where they are selling. So it's where they um, post their products. So they can also type in um, the order summary. So they can type in the quantity and which type of product and the member of a certain group if it's applicable. So you can actually add in small descriptions. So for example, over here, you want them to input a specific format for their Twitter username. All you have to do is to click that and add description. And then you can type in, for example, no links. So they just have to type in their actual username without sending you the link of their account. And over here, you can see that they can input the date of payment on when they paid and the like. So as you can see, there's also um, the thing that I have added earlier in the template where it says proof of payment. So I think that's essential when it comes to order forms, especially when it's a pay as you order basis. So if you want to see how the form looks like, it looks like this. So as you can see, it is a very simple to fill order form. So yes, I hope you learned something from this video. May you tune in for more. Thank you.